Square up. Square up, Chris. Come in. It's harder, you. Look at the seriousness on my face. You're probably wondering, how did I get in this situation? Well, for that to be answered, we have to rewind to the beginning. If I pull up in that vroom, 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 just to get back to that ooh, Demi God, and gotta see us. What's going on, YouTube fam? Like, it's your boy, Kamad Black, and I'm back on this total drama. Whoa, say it with me. Oh. Episode 5, Broadway Baby. Okay, in the last episode, Bridget. I'm not going to talk about Bridget's plight because I talked about it in the last episode. Uh, so it's just sad to see her go. I feel like she has so much potential. But with that being said, we get to see other stars shine. With Duncan being gone, Harold being gone, basically everybody that went deep into last season with the exception of a few are gone. But you get a chance to see new people shine like Sierra, a lot of people telling me Tyler, Noah, Cody, all of them stepping up. So let's see. So without further ado, let's get it right to the video. The Yukon, Canada's frozen gem. Here our okay. competitors discovered the thrill of ice flow jumping, the chill mm -hmm. of dog sledding, and the buzzkill of yes. Bridget romance. In the end, Bridget said goodbye, not that we could understand her. The Yukon, live the adventure. Where will we dump our remaining competitors this time? Find out right now on Total Drama. Today we eat the breakfast of champions. Is that oatmeal? Like, what is that? It looks like they're eating cottage cheese, and that's the breakfast of champions, Alejandro. Damn. Okay. Look at how Tyler is. Look, look how they looking at each other. Victory tastes good, I guess. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's the spot. Oh, look at Big O. His fear of flying is so adorable. Uh, finally. Thanks for not noticing I was missing all night. What am I, Tyler? Hey. Yo, my man. No. Stupid economy section. What is that horrible smell? My man is paralyzed from the, the neck down. Someone wasn't whipping me. We both know that's not true. Oh, first chance we get, I'll totally help you vote her off. Gladly. Can we whip her off? Whip me off? Ha! Huh. Not if I can prove my worth to the team. Or manipulate Sierra and Cody into slavishly obeying me. Whatever okay. works. This will warm you Which up are like no um, long hair no Heather, one, Pocahontas Heather, or um, this You'll think of me. ponytail Heather? Which no one? Kidding. I don't know. Hey, buddies, have Both I kind said of fire. How much I value your friendship? You've only spoken to me like three times ever, including this one. Well, I value you too, Heather. Huh? I think just saying it is enough. How's our team ever How tall is he, bro? Three of us she left. looks six the four, bro. Let me talk, you guys. We are quitters. We're Fighters, and we're winners! Mm hmm girls got fire in her eyes! I packed a seasoned supply of lip gloss, and I've barely finished one tube! No way am I going home yet! Ladies, 
I took okay. the liberty of smuggling a few things out of first class. I better not. I might break out. Oh, is that a snuffer's bar? Eee! Didn't I say Lindsay was next? My former teammate. I smuggled this one out just for you. Well, she doesn't want it. We never trust the enemy. Yo, they voted the my man. Cody disgustingly like a flirty prince. ones. No thanks. Enemy. Of course Heather's bonding with Sierra. She's Chris's favorite. And if that manipulative minx gets Sierra... Oh, never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. He meant Sierra is Chris's favorite. Okay. I thought... I thought he meant that Heather is Chris's favorite. I was about to say my all the way back in season one thoughts when they was working together. You know, but nah. I'm still looking stupid, so <laughs> let's continue. She'll have Chris too. Oh, she's good. Mm -hmm. And she's bad. Don't forget that. Handle, Beautiful, I'll intelligent. We're going. Put oh, all of them sweet together. Boat guy. Right, Lindsay? Um, sure. A Dave is it? Why are you wearing a light jacket? They didn't even get the because first letter right. Of you, <laughs> but only one valuable me. Hit it, chef! Chris, bro. It would be no you if it was no them. Welcome Nobody to remember you from that badminton uh, movie. <laughs> it gave you a one out of ten on Rotten Tomatoes. Do you know how many stories IMD. there are here? I'm gonna buy like ten seasons worth of lip gloss without even trying. <laughs> Your first challenge is a carriage Lindsay, you need to be focused on winning. Park. Which I like it's only three of y'all left. Liberty or death. Oh, I've always dreamed of riding a horse-drawn carriage. <laughs> Don't even think about making me the horse, Heather. Slow down, confusion <laughs> jumpers. It's a baby carriage race. Huh? So where are the carriages? Yeah. Where are the babies? Oh, you climbing gloves. <laughs> I think your mischievous spirit makes the game. Thank you, Sierra. It's nice to be appreciated. Appreciated? I love you. I always did. Even way back when you were making those terrible movies about talking cats. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I was even going to call my first fan club the Christians, but that name was already taken. Okay. <laughs> Less chatter, more splatter. Er, climbing, more climbing. We'll leave the splatter That's to fate. That's crazy, Anywho, bro. Anywho, once you reach Lady Liberty's crown, pull up your rope to bring your team See, up. The air is just different, once bro. Once everybody's up, your team grabs the correct carriage off the spike, races back down to your boat, and follows the buoys to your next exciting destination. This is and definitely so a GTA mission. Um, so I've seen when this. Can we go shopping? I did you this don't. with Franklin. See, Erin need to realize, like, she don't need to be the fanboy of all these other people. She need to be a fanboy of herself. She is now a contestant on the show, which means she is just as equal as everybody else that's here. Why don't I go first and make sure it's safe for you ladies? She still don't see herself as an equal. You're not going to suggest we belay again, are you? Because that worked so well in Egypt. But no, I... Never mind. I think Sierra should decide. <laughs> OMG. I thought I knew Sierra got a big ass head like me. On this show. You're really nice, Heather. Of course, I know Heather's playing me. I've seen every episode like 15 times. Hello. I'm playing Heather. Okay, Sierra. No, no way am I losing this challenge? After you, I insist. She just want to take a look at them cheeks, Sierra. Don't. Best view in New York City. <sighs> look, he trying. Don't hide the cheeks now. You should have thought about that before. Be like, no, you go first, Sierra. I insist. I'm worried about Chris. Do you ever get the feeling he misses his glory days, back when he was a huge star? That he feels like no one remembers or cares. You've been hit by. You've been struck by. Chris, I remember. I care. Oh, I 
making me sweat. Okay, I gotta just. How did you even get in that predicament, bro? Tell me, what's the geometry on that? What's the physics? Are pure evil. Look at those. Hey, <laughs> takes one to know one. Oh. All I'm saying. Oh. Oh. Woo. Ten point landing, dude. Oh. What is what is that? The earlobe? Oh, that's the breast. This is. For a second, I actually thought I was gonna die in there. But what a way to go! <laughs> True <laughs> that. <laughs> My man was about to die in Let's the bosom go. of Lady Liberty. I'm tired. I'm hungry. And I gotta pee. What? Sweet. That's I'll crazy. I'll get the carriage, which is something only a really valuable teammate would do. Hey, Chris, know what? I own every one of your TV appearances on DVD, even your cooking show. <gasps> Keep it plain. Alejandro, bro. Alejandro. My man is so devious. He recognized from the jump that okay she's starting to get on chris nerves a little bit so he said you know what <laughs> i'm gonna push that even further <laughs> i'm gonna make her get on your nerve nerve you're not gonna have one single nerve no osmosis joan no pill that dropped down to save all the little germy germs that was going nothing <laughs> my man I'll give it up for him Give it up for him. Diabolical. That's how I would play the game if I was in there. Your recipe nah, for I wouldn't. White I'd play it like so probably. Great. It's totally unfair. You got canceled after only one I'd probably episode. play it like Gwen or something. I don't know. I'll play it like somebody whack. I was going probably Tyler. I'm making fun of Tyler. I'll play it like Tyler. Like I said, valuable. Team Amazon takes the lead. How do we get back down? Fireman's pull, anyone? It's only a 30-story drop. How you put a fireman's pole on Lady Liberty? Where is your permit? Well, someone's got to do it. <laughs> Here goes. The mayor did not approve of this. Hallelujah! I'll get the carrot. Oh, my man is. <laughs> I always walk on the edge of the curb, never on the sidewalk. Can't risk stepping on a crack and breaking mama's back, know what I'm saying? Know what I'm saying? Nah, me. <laughs> nah, me. Where am I? Echo! <laughs> Come on, team. we looking bad. Oh my. Nice one, is he? Izzy would make a great adult actress if you know what I'm saying. I'm just saying. You think I'm you not, give uh, me a push out? Oh, great big apples. Oh man. Uh, <laughs> I wouldn't deserve that, man. Sometimes. Who will survive? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. What? Dive. Find out when we return on Total Drama World Tour. My man want to be Johnny Depp so bad. He want to be Robert Downey Jr. so bad. He's not them. Was that an alligator? There aren't any alligators in the sewers. That's just an urban myth, right? You Golly. I didn't know he was in Lake Placid.
stink. That's the kind of stink that never comes out. Make the gator sign a waiver so we can show it on TV. Chris, you are such a brilliant commander. That's why you always stood out in your boy band. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chris was in a boy band? Moving on. Back in the 80s, he was. Making trouble is easy to do. But making you love me is painful. You were in fame town? <laughs> <laughs> what? I want to see it. I want to like show me the show me the clip or something. I what really admire for? the way you never let mockery get to you. I'll have to include that in your obituary. I already have a draft. Want to hear? Chris McLean was born in 1978. That is it. 78. 78, let me do the math right now. 22, that would be 2000 plus 21. My man is 43. My man is 43 right now. This came out when? 2011? So he was 30 something back then? Golly, got some age to you. Ugh. 78? Permanently! Oh. A 70s baby? Sierra could have been Chris's pet all season, but she threw it away, which makes her way less useful. How could this have happened? Wait a minute. That smile. Alejandro. That sneaky jerk. <laughs> it's really on now. Just you wait. All right, focus people. Welcome to the mm. second half of the challenge. Bobbing for Big Apples NYC style. Here's how it's going to go down. Know. Teams must push their characters might be like this one of the three tied for second baddest in the game. Bridges is always going to be number one in me. I'm sorry. One member team will bob for some very special apples using only their mouths. No hands. Once they get it to shore, the rest of the team must load it into their carriages and race to the I finish said, line Ma. in the heart of Central Park. And what's a baby carriage without a baby? Oh, oh, a shopping cart. It was a rhetorical question. Oh, Chris. That, that said, is so... Zip it! One member of each team must ride in their carriage and stay there all the way to the finish line. Come. Hey. I'll do it. Oh, and I'll do it for Team Victory. I love it when people call me baby. Make a mental note of that, bro. I don't have a pen. Victory got here first. Call so me baby. The shortest path to the you pond. have some daddy issues Chris then. Is really, 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 really hot. See, that's it's the root the of the problem. The that's left. why Lindsay act like this. Amazon gets the longest path on the right. Oh, and a little traveling music, please. It's always been a dream of mine to dance in New York City. So we're Go ahead, really then. doing this music part every single time. You out down and get your eagle on, girl. Move it. We only have permits to cordon off this section of the park for another hour. What does that even mean? Get your eagle on. What's not to oh, no. love about New York City? The? Taxis honk out of New York City. The crime is high. The pigeons fly. What's not to love about New York? The lights are brighter. The fun is funner. The bagels are bigger and the bums are bummer. The dirt and crime make every alley shine. What's not to love about New York? Oh, the stores. They be offbeat like a it motherfucker. Shows passion. It's crazy because the city never sleeps. Oh, fuck it up. Fuck it up. The love of dance, stop. Subway trains and the hustle bustle. Cap the cheese while the mobsters tussle. And pretzel stands for all us pretzel Whoa, fans. Hot, hot, hot. What's not to love? What's not to love? What's not to love? Okay. Well, um, for one, uh, it's like seven thousand dollars for a box this big. You live in. You have no refrigerator, no appliances, no heater. Remember, no hands. That's pretty much it. I've totally got this, guys. Yo, what is in that water? My hair, my lip gloss. I. If we lose, it's not my fault. Uh, get the job done then. I don't know nobody that could cover for him. My perfect ballet leaps close the gap. Now someone dive in before we lose the advantage. Ooh, last year I broke my leg in the egg and spoon race at the Chris McLean fan club picnic. Oh, 
Hold up. There's a Chris McLean fan club picnic? It's awesome. There were like six of us. Anyway, I had to stay off it for over a month, and I took this SEAL training course online. <laughs> <laughs> Handy, huh? I repeat, dive in! Here, please get hold it off the map. so romantic, don't you find? Is Whatever. this a reward you know episode? You've been messing with Sierra's head, so back off, or you'll wish you had. My wish doesn't involve backing off. Ugh! Just go play with your stupid team and leave us alone! You're beautiful when you play hard to get. I'm going. You bet you are. Right out of the game. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, that, oh, that's a milk. That girl kind of nice looking. A little nice, a little. It's not working. Come on. Okay. Man. Use your head. I need to stop sexualizing people. Ah, evil turtles. It's called Turtle Pond for a reason, bro. <laughs> Snapping turtles? Knowing DJ, he gonna kill every single one of them. You are so weird. We gonna be having Quick, soup tonight. Barely in the lead. Good shit, Tyler. Good shit. That's the second the time line. Tyler has stepped up on a nick. Let's give it up. Cause you know what I'm saying? Things like that go unnoticed. Whew. Okay, Mr. Nibbles. Back to your home. No. <laughs> because you're cursed. That's why. Now snap out of it and let's go. Why would a turtle eat another turtle though? Well, it was a turtle, and then the tortoise came out of nowhere and just snapped them. That's crazy. Got a sister, you know? For real? All right, give him my digits, man. Oh, hold on. Here they come. Where are they? Who got a sister? <laughs> what y'all talking about? Into a baby. I forgot. Oh, and he ate all my pretzels. Wait, this isn't our carriage. No, Noah means no first place. We have to go back. Okay, now who gets a big kiss? Ah! Ah! Oh. <laughs> yeah! What we lost, and the winner of the New York challenge is. Team Amazon! Yeah! Yes! yes! Yeah! Team Victory, congrats on not coming in last. Woo! And Team Chris is really, 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 really hot. You're facing elimination for the first time. But Bro, why is every damn... Can we get a reward? Can I get some damn banana pudding or something? Stop eliminating people. God damn! Unless you gonna bring Duncan back? Are you bringing Duncan back? Are are they bringing Duncan back? Don't don't tell me. I don't want to know. If they are, they are. But uh, you won't have to go through with it because this is really a reward challenge. <laughs>
How about it, ladies and babies? That's, hey. that's crazy. That's crazy. They just, just, just disrespect. Just the disrespect. Candy. Oh, candy. Hey, leave some for the rest of us. Oh, of course. No problem. Sure thing. <laughs> Come to Papa. Are you a candy addict? Yay! Apples! Can I thank Chris for the apples? No. Right no. I think I deserve to open the last one. All things considered, the carriage spot did help us win. But we wouldn't have lost either way. So don't get all big-headed. Oh my... Okay. <laughs> X-23. The meat grinder? Oh, This must be the booby prize. Forget it. Oh, maybe we should keep it just in case. <laughs> really is satisfying. Will Heather ever manage to earn the respect of her teammates? Um, I'm standing right here. Find out next time <laughs> on Total Drama World Tour. Well, that's the end of the episode. I hope you guys did enjoy. Uh, if you did, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe if you're new. And the plot is thickening. So, Heather, know that Alejandro is scheming because it takes one to know one. Um, pretty much nobody else knows about Alejandro except Bridget. Um, Noah is getting disrespected along with Cody. Tyler is showing his worth. He's definitely doing a lot. He's doing a lot for the team. He's putting the team not on his back, but he's carrying his load. Um, so you got to give him respect for that. Tierra is still a weirdo. I can't get over that image of her smelling. Courtney is still trying to control. Gwen is just, she don't know what she want to be, but Gwen is here. She, she didn't really get as deep as how they get in, how they got in action, but it's cool. Um, I'm looking forward to the next video. I'm about to watch it right after this. So see you next time. Yeah.